how much longer will investors continue to allow Amazon to fund Zooks without offering any clarity on the business? So right now you're getting social media pictures of the toaster ovens kind of rolling down the street and then you're going to get people riding them. And then if they launch a new market, so that again, gets back to what I said with GM, like you can create a narrative. Everything is relative, right? You have Tesla making new all time highs in part because you have analysts that are doing some of the parts that will say, okay, the autonomous robo taxi thing is worth a trillion dollars. So Amazon would be like, look, hey, we're over here. We may not be making any money, but if you think it's a trillion dollar market opportunity and we only get 20% of that, you know, here's the relative. It's a narrative that's in there. And, and, and like, oh, you're going to attack us, Amazon? Should I play you all the clips of people that were saying, like, how can you not make money? Like the talk show host interviewing Bezos saying, like, how, you know, how are you not making money and, and like generating any, any value? So I think they get a lot of rope especially in this space, which is perceived to be a huge market opportunity. Now it's incumbent upon them and the people at Zooks to deliver. And like the question is, do they have the right people at Zooks to deliver? We've heard questions about that. Does then that does therefore someone outside of Zooks within Amazon start asking questions about Zooks and like, well, maybe we should be bringing teams of people over from crews or other, you know, or other companies out there to help build some girth around whatever strategy that Zooks is, is executing on right now.